Hello, my name is Vidya Lala. I am a family medicine resident at Madigan Army Medical Center. Today's presentation is titled Fostering Diverse Perspectives in Medicine Through Analysis of Artwork. This project stemmed from an existing assignment within the Internal Medicine Department at the Uniformed Services University. For this assignment, medical students use the military's 4 CPDO framework as a scaffolding for their reflective piece. This framework emphasizes qualities to include character, competence, context, and communication at a personal, interpersonal, team, or organizational level. Students were instructed to choose an image from an existing PowerPoint slide deck to connect to patient experiences, as well as to analyze leadership and professional qualities of physicians. Reviewing the images of the slide deck, many of the pictures depicted male Caucasian physicians acting in dominant patriarchal and paternalistic roles, which did not seem very reflective of modern medicine. Today's healthcare has shifted towards a patient-centered and shared decision-making model, which incorporates patients' experiences and input into the decision-making process. Additionally, both Physician and patient populations have become more diverse over the years and were not well represented in these images. Voicing this concern, a student was encouraged to create a new slide deck with more representative images. It was then that this project was developed with the goal of expanding upon the original assignment of analyzing leadership and professional qualities of physicians with the addition of considering the patient's sociocultural context. The images were mainly chosen from Google Images using pointed keywords to find relevant pictures and thereafter were displayed using PowerPoint as demonstrated in the attached handout. A few selected images from the new PowerPoint were chosen for display on this poster. I am happy to discuss any of the images in detail as well as the reasons for their selection during the live poster session. However, overall, the goal was to display a smattering of images from several different cultures, along with notable events faced by specific populations in order to expand the framework in which patients are viewed. The student who developed the slide deck used one of her images to complete the reflective assignment. This, the image she chose is shown at the bottom of the third column and depicts a drawing of Nigel Shelby, a 15-year-old black gay boy who committed suicide. Reflecting on this image, the student analyzed the interactions between an endocrinologist and his patient, who identified as a transgender male. The patient was currently undergoing testosterone treatments to facilitate his transition. During the encounter, the endocrinologist displayed empathy by acknowledging the challenges of taking daily injections and further discussed future treatments to eventually consider upon FDA approval. Furthermore, the physician considered the patient's social environment and support structure, engaging with the individual as a whole, beyond simply his endocrine system, to comprehend how his external environment and mental state might impact his health. In the article associated with Nigel Shelby's picture, the writer references the higher levels of depression and suicide that exist among members of the LGBTQ community, especially among the youth, and emphasizes the importance of actively working towards mental health care for these individuals. Through her reflective piece, the student noted how the physician appeared to be responding to this calling. Overall, the student demonstrated through the reflective piece she developed that images representative of diverse patient experiences and cultures may lead to unique analyses of patient encounters and may also allow us to consider a broader context when defining what constitutes leadership and professionalism in medicine. Due to the COVID-19 pandemic, the reflective assignment was temporarily removed from the IM curriculum with plans for re-implementation in 2022. However, the original intent was to implement both the new and the old slide decks for the reflective assignment to allow students to choose from any of the images. Thereafter, data would be collected to analyze student attitudes towards the assignments, as well as rationales regarding the image that they ultimately chose. Additionally, the Family Medicine Department expressed interest in using similar methodology of analyzing audiovisual artwork to connect with patient experiences with an emphasis on considering the individual social determinants of health and how that impacts their care. I 
hope you enjoyed hearing a bit about my presentation. I look forward to seeing you at the poster session and answering any questions you may have then. Thank you for your time. I hope you have a great day.